Want to help sue your landlord for jacking up rent? I'm going to break down how you can help strengthen the lawsuit the state of Arizona has filed against nine rental management companies that run thousands of rental units across the state. Arizona Attorney General Chris Mays claims that these landlords secretly work together to raise rents in unison so they could make record profits while causing rents in the state to go up by 30%. And these aren't mom and pop landlords. They weren't invited to join in on the price fixing. It's investment firms working to make the ultra wealthy even more wealthy. So if your rent has gone up or if a bunch of excessive fees have been added to your payments like doorstep trash service or vague convenience fees, you can file a complaint with the state and strengthen their case. If they win, rents can go back down to being affordable again and you might even get some money back. This URL right here will take you to the confidential fraud complaint form, meaning your landlord won't know you reported them unless you say it's okay. You'll have to enter your information as well as who you rented from, some brief details on how your landlord overcharged you, and any documentation you have. So if you have any invoices showing your rent was raised by more than 3% or that outline new fees or luxury services that you couldn't opt out of, make sure to upload those. Even if you don't live there anymore, submitting a complaint helps the case against rental price fixing. So take a few minutes and make the claim. You should also know that this is a fraud complaint for a criminal case, not a class action lawsuit. You're not required to do anything by the courts by submitting this claim, and the attorney general can't stop any related legal action you're involved with, like if you're facing eviction. Here at the Copper Courier, we're also working on some stories about this massive conspiracy to price fix rents. So if you were impacted, send us a DM or let us know in the comments. And follow our page for more updates on affordability, housing, and everything Arizona.